Gloria al Padre, al Figlio e allo Spirito Santo, come era nel principio e ora e sempre, nei secoli dei secoli. Amen. L'eterno riposo dona loro, Signore, e splenda ad essi la luce perpetua, riposino in pace. Amen. Questi rami colti a vostra memoria nei giardini della terra divengano simbolo e speranza del vostro ingresso negli eterni giardini del Padre Celeste. Per Cristo nostro Signore. standing next to the Tiber River on the island of the Tiber. This island was formed back in 291 BC when there was a great epidemic here and the Romans were so distraught that they needed to go to Greece to get help from the Greek gods to cure their people. So they sailed the ship there. When they got there, a giant snake, which they believe was a reincarnate 
of the god Ascyphorus, which is the son of Apollo and also known as the god of healing. They brought that giant snake back on their boat. As they were sailing up the Tiber River, the snake jumped off the boat and buried itself in the island here. Now, we never noticed this before, but I want you to look for this. They made this island in the shape of a ship so that people would always remember the history and the miracle of the healing snake that came and healed so many of the Romans. So if you view it from the mast where Scott is standing, which used to have a giant obelisk on the top of it, you can see it raises up like the front of a ship and goes back and is shaped that way all the way back. That way that they were always pay tribute to the god of healing, Ascivius, the son of Apollo, whose reincarnate, the snake, is buried underneath this island.